Hi guys, it's Eileen and Shannon with the sisters. Today we're coming to you for the first time from our brand new office. Brand new office. So we just walked in for the first time. Getting it all set up. But uh, first we wanted to kind of go over some tips for sellers um, as you're kind of preparing for your closing, what is expected of you and how you should leave your house. So the first thing a lot of people ask us is when they have art hanging on the wall, any pictures, what do they do with those nail holes? You are not required to patch and repaint those um, whenever you're moving out unless that's negotiated in the contract. Uh, people always ask us about cleaning. You're, per the terms of the sales agreement, you should be leaving your property in broom clean condition. So all the garbage out, counters wiped down, um, appliances cleaned, make sure it just looks good. For really, you just want to leave it in a condition that you would want to find your new home in. Uh, another thing that you want to make sure you're taking care of are uh, the utilities. So you're going to call the utility companies, let them know the day you're closing, um, but do not have the utilities turned off. The new buyer is actually going to call and have them transferred into their name, but you want to make sure you leave them on all the way until closing day. We also want to mention landscaping. So we recommend uh, maintaining the landscaping through closing. So cut your grass, um, water your flowers. You don't want the new buyer to arrive at the house and have dead plants. To or overgrown lawn. You want to make sure it's cut and looks good. Uh, the other thing is trash. So all the trash in your house, you're going to have a lot of stuff you're throwing out. You want to make sure you have that all out the week before um, at the curb um, or take it to a dumpster. You don't want to leave all your cans in the garage filled so that the new homeowner has to take your stuff down to the street uh, the first week that they live in the house. So at this point, um, anything that's left in the house should be discussed prior to closing. So if you want to leave any extra paint cans or extra flooring, this should be discussed prior to closing. And most people want that stuff, they do. but you just want to get approval, anything that's left in the home. You don't want to be left at closing day having to haul that all out yourself. Yeah. So. So hopefully this was helpful. Uh, so you're kind of prepared for your closing Happy day. Closing. Happy closing day. And we'll see, see you, you guys week. next week.